Hi, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and in today's video, we'll talk about what to do when your GE microwave isn't working despite having power. Watch until the end of the video to learn more. There could be a problem with the control panel's settings. Incorrect settings can prevent the microwave from working properly despite having power. Start by checking the power level, cooking time, and cooking mode. Consult your user manual if you're unsure about the settings. If everything checks out but the problem persists, your microwave's door switch mechanism could be faulty. The door switch stops the microwave from working when the door is open. Here's how to inspect and replace a faulty door switch. First, unplug your microwave and locate the door switch. It's usually behind the latch mechanism or control panel. Next, use a multimeter to test the switch's continuity. Check if it has continuity when the door is shut and none when it's open. If it's faulty, replace it. If the door switch works, the high-voltage diode could be damaged. The high-voltage diode converts current from the capacitator into a lower voltage for the magnetron. If it's faulty, your microwave won't heat even with power. Here's how to inspect and replace the diode. First, unplug your microwave, then detach its grill and control panel. Next, detach the inner access panel and discharge the capacitator by touching its terminals with insulated needle nose pliers. Remove the screw holding the diode to the frame and pull it out. Install the new diode and screw it into the frame before reattaching the inner access panel, control panel, and grill. Restore power to your microwave and test it. If you're unsure about replacing the high-voltage diode, contact a technician. So, there you have it. That's what to do when your GE microwave isn't working despite having power. Thanks for watching. Till next time.